Welcome to TLDL, your AI-powered note-taking and study companion. Let's walk through the basics of the app. Once you've created your account, you'll be directed to the home screen, which will initially be empty. This is where all of your notes and study guides will appear, providing you 24-7 access to them. Let's create a new note. Start by selecting the Add New Note button on the bottom of the screen. From there, you'll be given six options. Record a class, upload audio, upload text, upload a PDF, web links, and upload a YouTube video. Let's begin with the first option, recording a class. If you're in a lecture or class and wish to record, select record. This will bring up the recording screen. Once recording, you'll have the option to bookmark timestamps in the recording that may be of significant importance to you, as well as adding a photo or note to the recording. You can go back to these attachments when viewing the transcript, which we'll get into. And don't worry, adding these attachments will not stop the recording process. Record for as long as you need, and once you're done, hit the stop button on the bottom of the screen, then press save. Your notes and study tools will be generated and will appear on the home screen in just a few seconds. Tap on your note to see a more detailed view, and once you're in, scroll down to examine the detail of your note, ranging from highlights, key points, summaries, timelines, and more. Now, scroll back to the study tool page, where you'll find the study tool option. Select the first one, Quiz Me Now. You'll receive a quiz based on your lecture, featuring a range of question types from multiple choice to true and false, and more. After completing the quiz, you'll see a results screen reviewing the stats from your latest attempt. You can use these to track your progress. To exit, tap the X in the top left-hand corner of your screen to return to your note. Next, select the flashcard option. You'll instantly receive flashcards based on your lecture. Once done reviewing, again, you'll be taken to a results page where you can gauge your understanding of the topic. Tap the X in the top left-hand corner to go back to the note. Selecting copy note will copy the entire note, allowing you to paste it into different apps such as the Notes app or Google Docs. Returning back to the note, selecting rewrite note will allow you to rewrite the current note generated in a variety of different ways. Start by selecting a rewrite option I'll select explain like I'm five and then watch it rewrite the note for you in that style. Once rewritten, you can either accept, reject, or retry. I'll accept and watch as your note is rewritten in the style that you've chosen. Now there are a variety of options in this tab, including a personalized option, which allows you to rewrite the note in any way you feel. Feel free to explore the various rewrite options that TLDL offers. Pressing the share button allows you to share just the note summary, transcript, or the entire note. If selecting the entire note option, Turn the toggle on or off to determine whether anyone with the link can access the note or not. Selecting more options allows you to view the transcript of the class, ensuring you don't miss any key details. You can also search for specific keywords by tapping the magnifying glass in the upper right hand corner. In the transcript tab, you'll also be able to view anything that you bookmarked or added as an attachment while recording. Hitting back and selecting more options again, TLDL also allows you to translate your note in over 50 languages. The final feature within the note is the Ask AI button. Selecting this allows you to open TLDL's Ask AI feature, which gives you the ability to ask any question related to your lecture and get an answer that can help you understand the topic more in depth. Now that we've covered how to record a class and navigate the note, let's quickly review the other methods of generating a note. Starting with voice memos, this is fairly straightforward. Open your voice memos app, select the recorded audio, and tap the three dots in the upper right hand corner. From there, choose share and select TLDL notes. Tap add in the upper right hand corner and that's it. All your notes and study guides will be created from that voice memo and you'll have access to the same kind of notes and study guides regardless of how you choose to generate notes. So you don't have to worry. Now let's go over how to upload text. Again, fairly straightforward. Select upload text, then either type or paste out the text in the text box, then tap add in the upper right hand corner and it'll turn your text into instant study guides, summaries, and more. Now let's go over adding a PDF. For this, select Upload PDF, then select the PDF icon for TLDL to open your files app. From there, you'll be directed to your files home screen. Select the file that you want to be converted into a note. From there, tap Add in the upper right hand corner. And once again, you'll get a complete note and study guide based on that PDF. The next option is web link. Head over to any website, then copy the link. After that, head back into TLDL, paste the link, tap add in the top right corner, and from there, you'll get instant notes and summaries based on your web link. The final option is a YouTube link. Start by entering the YouTube app and selecting the video you want to be converted into a note. Once selected, tap the three dots in the bottom right hand corner, then tap share, select copy link, and once you have copied the link, head back into TLDL and paste the link into the text box. Once pasted, select add in the top right hand corner, and once again, you'll get instant notes and study guides 
summarize based on your video. Now that we understand all the methods of generating a note, let's go over two more key features. The first being scan to ask. Start by heading back to the home screen and tapping the camera icon in the bottom left hand corner. This will open up your phone's camera. From here, you can take a picture of any question and our AI will be able to solve it for you. Start by pointing your phone at the problem and when you're ready to capture the image, tap solve. After hitting solve, crop the image to your liking, then select the check mark. Once this is done, our AI will begin to solve the problem for you, generating you a right answer in seconds. The second way of using scan to ask is by uploading an image. Head back to the home screen and select the camera in the bottom left once again. Instead of pointing your camera and hitting solve, press the picture icon in the bottom left hand corner. This will open up your phone's camera roll. Select the photo you wish to be solved, crop it to your liking, and press the check mark. Again, once this is done, our AI will begin solving the problem for you and generating you a right answer in seconds. The final topic we'll cover is how to create a class and invite classmates. So, what exactly is a class in TLDL? A class is a way to organize your notes based on the subject you're studying. To create one, tap the book icon in the bottom right corner, then select create in the bottom middle. Enter your class name and its schedule, and you're all set. From now on, whenever you record a class, select save to class, and you'll be able to choose which class that recording gets stored in. This helps to keep your notes organized within the app. Next, let's move on to inviting classmates to a class. Start by selecting a class you want to invite members in. Tap the members button and tap invite members. Then enter their email addresses and assign their role. Once they're added, they'll have access to any of the notes that anyone uploads to that class, creating a more collaborative and interactive study environment. So with that being said, we hope that you found this tutorial helpful and as always, happy note taking.